Alrighty, um, I was just getting everything set up for this break that is about to happen um, at 7. All teams are filled, so thank you all for that. Thank you all for filling the teams and um, doing that, which is amazing. Very much appreciated. Don't have to struggle with trying to get rid of any teams now last second um thankfully there's enough people in this group to where if there's any teams left over or that need to be bought that there are plenty of people who will take them um which is awesome i very much appreciate it now something that i am gonna try um to do is you see in the back here we've got optic i have five blasters and i have some of these Pokemon mini tins. Um, I've never opened up Pokemon in my break group before, but I will open up these if anyone wants to do a rip and ship, if you know what that is. If not, basically you just send me, um, send me costs of it. So here I've got, um, let's see, I, I think I've got Optic Blasters at 75, and I've got these tins at 20. So you send me either 75 bucks for the Optic Blaster or 20 bucks for this tin. And I will open it live. Um, I'll obviously send it with your cards. Send them with your cards. So we'll try it. We'll see if anyone's interested in that. I mean, I'll do a break out of this, but I only have five. And doing the math, five times 28 is... Uh, about like 140 so that means each team might be able to get like th four cards on average which shipping that um would be fine but there might be some people who don't get any cards so then i'd have to refund them and i don't want to deal with that so unless i get like five more of these i probably won't do a break um I'm actually assuming I might get five more of them, so I might just hold off for a break. But I'll throw them up here if anyone wants them. Also, these new Celebration tins um, are out. So 20, 20 bucks rip and ship. Add five if you want it ship sealed, and I can do that. So, yeah. So this break is supposed to take off at 7, and it's 6.49 at the moment, so that is in 11 minutes, and we are live. I like to start my videos a little early, um, so I could do rules and do a little intro by myself, which then it takes a few extra minutes, and then I don't get to rip in until like 7.05, 7.10 um, at the latest, but... Um, we are golden as far as teams, so there should be no delay in that. Um, if you are here also, and this is your break, you're in this break, leave a comment. Let me know that you are watching, because it shows I have zero viewers, and sometimes it does that, and I, in reality, I have... A few people viewing, which is a little strange. I don't know why it does that. Facebook is a little strange with the videos, how they how they roll. So if you're watching this and if you're in the break, leave a comment. Say, I'm here, and even say what team you have if you want. So, oh, Andre... Andre Bell has to join you up. So that's another thing is people throughout the break will join as it's going on. Um, as the break's going on. Which is totally fine. I'll try to keep updated with that. But if you miss any part of the break, 
you could uh, rewatch it on my Facebook group as much as you want. It's got the date here, so I will also go over the, t the team and the name so that you'll see that you're in the right break, which will be nice. This is my last Chronicles draft pick mega box I've got. So hopefully we get something good out of here. I've got this prestige mega box. I think I might have three others. So if anyone, I might offer it. If anyone wants to swap it out for a different one, I will gladly do that. Um, I like to offer that so that people have the choice of, you know, so that it's not like I'm picking all the boxes. So if anyone wants to swap this out for a different prestige mega box i'll offer it again later then we will go ahead and do that and for sure i am going to have you anyone who's in this break pick out whatever of the five remaining uh prism draft pick h2 hobby box that i have because um these i only i only had five and i have four remaining the last break I let them choose, they chose one that actually wasn't too great. So, um, again, I do it for the same reason. I, I like to give you, you all options on what to choose, what you want. We've got one autograph and two silver prisms in here, which is very nice. Hopefully a Trevor Lawrence in one of them and a Fields in the other one. And let's see, a Mac Jones in the other. And let's go with a Zach Wilson in the last one. That's probably what these are. So choose your fate. <laughs> It's crazy to think, though, that one of these retail alone cost one thirty. I'm actually gonna look it up. How much they are selling for right now? Prism draft picks uh, H two box. Cause like one of these retail one thirty plus tax. Like that's just insane. <laughs> Either <laughs> like it's nuts. But I got them for the breaks. Not any for myself. That would be... I'd go broke. I'll do an intro about myself in a little bit, and you'll hear that I <laughs> am not rich. So these are still on eBay, 135 about. Okay, that's so strange. I thought these would go up by now, but I'm I'm assuming they probably will after the season ends. And when there's less out there. I mean, I don't even know how many. But, I mean, that's how that's typically how it goes is when there's, as time goes on, less and less are sealed, which means the price will go up no matter what for whatever product it is. But it's whether you stay up to date, whether the good stuff has been opened or not. <laughs> Because, like, if there's, if you're chasing a one of one card, well, I don't know if there's any one of ones out of here. I'll actually look. But if you're chasing a one of one card and you see that it's already been opened, then you could, and that's the one you want, then you could at least know that it is not there. Dang. 108 plus shipping? After eBay fees, that's like 80 bucks for this, which is outstandingly low. That's just super low. I don't get it. It's it's all going to go up after the season. I promise that when there's less sealed available. I promise that. But still, I mean, like 108 bucks for this? I paid 130 for that plus tax. 
even 108, that's outstandingly high. Because you get 60 cards. That's over a dollar a card. But you get cooler cards. Okay, so let's see. From 50 to 5. Number from probably 50 to 5. So, I mean, you could get out of five cards out of here. That's as low as it goes. All right, it is 6.56, so I will... Go over the rules and oh, six fifty seven now. I'll go over the rules in a little bit here, in a minute. Um, I'm just gonna pull up the break list, the name of all the teams and the team names, so that you know that you're watching the right video. I mean, I'm pretty sure you could tell if just by the date alone, but if you're watching it um, live or post live and you're like, "Am I watching the right video?" Well, here you go. So, I just did eBay your shipping names. Oh, I am going to have to tighten this up. One second. That is not straight. Let's see. There we go. I just did your eBay team names. So, up front we got Arizona. Going all the way down to Washington. And... VD, I don't know if I said your name right, VD. If you're here, also let me know. You are my Packer guy. Um, you are my Packer guy. So, those are all the team names. Rewatch it if you want. Rewind it. Pause it. Make sure that you're watching the right break. But, alright, so, rules on this break. Um, I make sure I say them before every break so that there's no confusion on what is... Uh, where cards are going. So college cards, college players, they um, they go to their current team that they're on. Um, if they're not on a team, I send them to whoever they got drafted by. And if they didn't get drafted, then I send it to whoever they were last on. So Jamie Newman, for example, he was last on the Eagles. So, yeah. Um, let's see what else. Panini points, I randomize.org that if there's any if you don't know what that is it's basically just a list randomizer so i will do a virtual dice on there and then i will list randomize it S someone will get uh, panini points and since well every football break i've done all spots have been taken but since yet again another break where all spots are taken even if there's a player that's not on a team or anything any card that's pulled out of here will go to someone. Whether I, I mean, if, even if they have never been been on a team and they are undrafted, there's only one time I ever ran into that. I just literally did a random dot org. It was an auto actually of some player, and I just did random dot org afterwards when I was sorting the cards and I uploaded the video so that people could see that who you know the proof who it was going to, and yeah. Uh, I just threw it in with some some random person's cards. So, um, anyways, uh, let's see. I'm trying to think. Hits will get top-loaded. Um, Big-name rookies will get sleeved and or top-loaded. Um, base cards will likely get shipped base, or as is. I will throw everything in a team bag anyways, So, which is like a big sleeve anyways, but... If I miss anything, just let me know. Um, for when you're watching the break, the right pile here, I'm going to do base pile. Middle pile is always sleep pile, and the left pile is top load pile. Um, also, one last thing. I'll offer it again when I get to the mega boxes and these, but these, the H2 hobby boxes, I had five to begin with, so I've only opened up one, and I'm down to four. So I, I let the last uh, break that had one, I let them choose which one out of the five they wanted. They chose one, and it was, I'll be honest, it was garbage. So um, there's four left, so I'll let you guys choose whatever box you want. Also, I have this mega box. Um, 
I have got three more, I think. So if anyone wants to swap this out, I will go get all the rest ones or the rest of them. Uh, if not, I mean, it's random anyways. If you trust me that I picked out a good one, then we'll do it. And this is the last Chronicles draft pick mega box I've got. So, um, let's see, John. Hope I'll make it to the uh, Hey, awesome, awesome. Thank you, John. Uh, uh, let's see. Yeah, that that is a okay. Um, I've got plenty more as as I'm sure you know. Um, but yeah, totally cool. If you want to watch this, or if you're watching this, hopefully. Hopefully, uh, it's entertaining, but hopefully, for your sake, we don't pull all the good stuff for your, for your team. So. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I have many more breaks in case anyone is wondering. I am doing a rip and ship. Um, I'm trying this out. If anyone's interested in Optic, I will, I got prices in my comment or these new celebrations. Um, but yeah, let's see, can I zoom in? I've got all this product up there. I've got another shelf with more product down there. Um, so, yeah, I've got tons more product to do lots more breaks. So I'll actually go over the team names again so you guys see. I'll just do a rerun of the team names so you could see that you're watching the right break. Okay, so um, a little intro about me, and then we will get this thing rolling. Uh, I am as... Uh, who, who actually was it? Michael? Mike? Let's see. Your eBay shipping name is Michael. But Mike, he took the Steelers, um, the Steelers were available, and he told me that he already saw a little bit about me, but just a f little bit about myself. I am from Green Bay, Wisconsin, so I'm a huge Packer fan. I love the Packers. I was actually at the last game against the Steelers. I got into that one for 50 bucks, and I was at the one before that against the Lions. And I was at the two preseason games, so I've been to Lambeau every single time that they played this season. Um, so I'm a huge Packer fan. I'm 22 years old in college, going for physical education i'm soon teaching right now so i don't make any money so any money i make from breaks really helps out a lot so i appreciate it but not just that i'm also saving up because uh, my grandpa is transferring two of his four season tickets into my name next season um and it's gonna cost twenty one hundred dollars just to put them into my name per seat like literally so that's four thousand two hundred dollars i'm gonna have to spend just to put them into my name um and then plus the price of the tickets every year, including next year. So next year is going to be the most expensive. But thankfully, that $2,100 is just a one-time fee. So I'm just saving up for that. Uh, any money I make is helping out for currently right now. And anything extra I have is going into my savings for when I get those tickets, which a few of you have told me that um, it's really cool because season waiting list is like 200 years long if i were to stay on it where i'm at right now i wouldn't get them until i'm 70 because i'm like 30,000 on the list so um it's the price i have to pay but it's a, it's okay but anyways also one last thing before i get into this break um well i mean also any money i make goes back to buying more product as you saw i have like thousands of dollars for the product plus supplies but anyways one last thing before i get into this break um, I don't know if anyone saw my post, but I used to work at the factory that makes all the NFL players' equipment. So um, we literally make every th one every one of the 32 NFL teams, game jerseys, game pants, hand warmers, um, etc. Not shirts or cleats or anything, but um, plus a lot of NHL, a lot of NCAA football a lot of basketball teams. We used to do NBA, but not anymore. But I used to work at the factory, actually, um, which is not far from Green Bay. And I got a lot of cool equipment there. So if anyone's interested, um, here's it. I'm actually, I actually just sold a Patriots jersey for 420 So I only, I'm only down to two jerseys left. But I've got a Chargers jersey. This is issued to a player. Oh, it's... Uh, Oh no, there we go. It's issued to Coda Martin. We've got AFC game pants. I've got quite a few of those. I'm selling those for forty five to fifty each. And then let's see, I've got I had a bunch of other teams, but all I have left is about twenty to thirty Eagles hand warmers. Um so these are authentic 
made for the players, as you can see, made in Berlin, Wisconsin, which is not far from Green Bay. So it's all legit, legit stuff. Um, unfortunately, VD, I was going to offer some stuff to you, but I keep all of my Packers stuff for the most part. I actually have Aaron Rodgers game worn pants. I don't know. I think. Oh, yeah, I showed you that. I already sent you that. But, yeah, this is like a real jersey that Coda Martin would play or wear in a game. Um, I'm selling this one for 150 if anyone's a Chargers fan or interested. Very cool, um, which is a steal because if you think about it, the most expensive retail jersey is like 300 320 But one last thing before I get this kicked off um, that is related to that is I sell these patches. I sell these a lot to people in my breaks. I'm most teams available. There's a few people in my breaks that actually cleared out a team. So, like, someone cleared out the Bills. I had 10 Bills patches, and since they bought all 10, I did a deal for, like, 25 bucks on all 10. Um, but I sell them for $4 a piece, $3 if you get... Three dollars a piece if you get more than five, and I have most teams available. And I just grabbed a baggie. I show them every time. Actually, a lot of people in my breaks buy these. So I mean, I got Redskins. This uh, this one actually is a Pro Bowl patch. So I got these from the factory as well. They're real authentic patches. Um, I've had a few people be like, "What would I use or even do with them?" Uh, you could, you know, collect them like you do with your cards. Or if you're into sewing, making your own jerseys, go right ahead. And this is actually also another Pro Bowl patch from the 2017. Or no, 2016 Pro Bowl. The 2016 Pro Bowl, they all had these gold outline. And I don't know if you could really see it, but the texture is sort of like rubberish. So, very cool. But if anyone's interested, let me know. I'll, I'll tell you which teams I have. Free shipping, I'll throw them in with your cards. Um, four dollars a patch. So, all right, here we go. We'll get this started. Enough talking. It's this is not actually gonna be a, a big break or a long break, anyways, because I like to keep my breaks around three hundred dollars worth of retail to three hundred to four hundred dollars worth of retail, <coughs> and this alone eats up about half of it. So, but if I weren't to do this, it would literally be. Um, it it would be uh how long um, or not how long uh how much like <coughs> that'd be an extra <coughs> uh six blasters, six to seven blasters. So for blasters wise, I mean megas had that still be two megas and I don't know two blasters still, which is just not or maybe even three blasters. I don't know, but it would be a lot of extra cards, but that alone eats up over half, or not over, but about half of the break, so this break won't be super long, but this Mega Box will be a pretty nice, pretty fun to rip also. All right, Najee Harris going to uh, Pittsburgh, which I think Michael got it. Michael S. took Pittsburgh. Sorry, I got a message. I just had to clear it. Oh, one second. I am going to see if this is anyone needing to join the... Yep. One person needs to join the group before I get before I finish this pack off. Here. It's not updating. Or it's not uploading. So I'll actually do the pack and then let them in. Najee Harris. Uh, Trevor Lawrence. Jamie Newman. Najee Harris again. Patrick Sertain, Caleb Farley, Sean Wade, Mac Jones, uh, Greg Razu, Carlos Bashman Jr., again, back-to-back. -back. I've seen this a lot with Pokemon recently with the new celebrations, but back-to-back -back cards, I think that's a printing error. Maybe not, but Chubba Hubbard. Here we got Najee Harris again. This pack is full of Najee. Uh, Elijah Moore and Mac Jones. All right, letting horror hey in. One second while I check my eBay. I got an eBay message. I think this is him. I just want to make sure everyone gets into this break um, and watches it. So if it is him, I accepted him. I think it is. <clears throat> All right, I will open up this next pack. 
Can you upload? I don't have. It. Okay, so someone needs it uploaded to YouTube, so I will upload it to YouTube. I'll also upload this to YouTube, but if you miss any part of the break, or if you want to re uh, rewatch anything, um, you could also do that on here. As I said before, you can rewatch it on here as much as you want, or you can rewatch my future breaks or my previous breaks, or you can watch my future breaks. Whatever, it's just like YouTube. I I prefer this. A lot more. Najee Harris again. Okay, a lot of Najee is coming out. Uh, Justin Fields. Kellen Mond. Travis Etienne. Trevor Lawrence. Rondell Moore. Jamie Newman. Trey Lance. There we go. Rondell Moore. Another Trevor Lawrence. Holy cow. Rashad Bateman. Terrence Marshall Jr. Kyle Trask, Kadarius Tony, and Seth Williams. Seth Williams. Okay, so those were the two. Um, Chronicles draft picks packs. Here we go with the two elite packs. I typically like to throw two of these packs in each break. Um, I cleared out Green Green Bay of these. Three stores, actually, of these Elite Packs. No kid report in the back. Uh, I cleared them out of three of these... Three stores. Oh, my gosh. I cleared out three stores of these packs and blasters. Not many people around here like them. These packs and the blasters got a price upgrade. So, for the price of these, you only get one rookie out of each pack, which is a little ridiculous in my mind. But I love Donruss. So, we actually have Donruss Blaster in here. But out of these... Literally everyone has been pretty terrible besides one I think I got Trevor Lawrence out of for someone in a break. Uh, but, I mean, one rookie is just terrible. But Stefan Diggs, Michael Thomas, Frank Gifford, Peyton Manning, DK Metcalf, Baker Mayfield, Miles Sanders, uh, Dalvin Cook, Derrick Henry, Der Jared Goff, Almost said Derek Goff. George Kittle, who's on IR. Joe Burrow. Mike Gesecki. Aaron Jones, my guy. Henry Ruggs. I actually have a few pictures of me and Aaron Jones. Fun fact. Kenneth Gainwell, sleeve that. Randy Moss, sleeve that. I like those letter cards. James Robinson. Brian Erlacher. Saquon Barkley, Larry Fitzgerald, Jalen Ramsey, A.J. Brown, Juju, Dan Marino, Derek Prescott, Josh Allen, Alvin Kamara, Brett Favre, who I was named after, and Darius Leonard. So, yeah, uh, as I sort of mentioned before, I have a lot of pictures of me and Aaron Jones. I haven't seen him recently, but when he was a rookie, I saw him around town probably... Uh, three to four times, and three of those times I got a picture of me and him, and it was funny, one of the times I was actually at the Packer Pro Shop, shopping, um, and I saw him and his family in there, and I was like, oh my gosh, you're Aaron Jones, and that was probably, I think that was my first time seeing him, because I made a big deal out of it, and his family was like, yeah, yeah, it's Aaron, uh, they were actually buying his jersey, literally, um, <laughs> and then, uh, I had his mom, Aaron Jones' mom, take a picture of me and him, and his mom <laughs> ended up taking a video. So she was like, here, how does this picture look? And she showed me the video, and Aaron Jones was like, oh, ma, come on now. And so then they retook, they retook it, and she retook a, an actual picture, which is pretty funny. But a few other times I saw him at Noodles and Company, and then the other time I saw him in downtown Green Bay. But here we go. Nick Boza. Patrick Mahomes, Aaron Rodgers, uh, Joe Montana, Jamal Adams, Nick Chubb, Randy Moss, uh, Ryan Tannehill, DeAndre Swift, Jimmy Garoppolo, T. Higgins, Michael Strahan. <laughs> a lot of Packers, actually. I'm not like typically I don't notice a lot of Packers coming out, but Devontae Adams. 
Uh, Mark Brunel. There we go. Trevor Lawrence. I'll top load that one. Nice card. Not numbered or anything, but nice. Payne Manning. Terry Bradshaw. Mark Brunel. Ben Roethlisberger. Daniel Jones. DeAndre Hopkins. Matthew Safford. Tom Brady. Tua. Luke Keekley, Drew Brees. Jerry Rice. Jonathan Taylor. TJ Watt. Zeke Elliott. We will top load this Trevor Lawrence because typically don't get many Trevor Lawrences with the uh, Jaguars logo actually on it. So not an insane hit, but not terrible either. For one of those packs, that's probably the best we could get actually. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, this is my first prestige uh, hanger that I'm also opening. <coughs> I ordered ten out, ten of them off Target, so I've got nine left. I'm probably just gonna throw one in each break, cause they're nothing special either. I don't think. But holy cow, do you get a lot of cards for a hanger box? Oh my gosh, this is beefy. Might be even more than oh Jalen Hurts in the back. Uh, might even be more than a mega box, actually. Yeah, it is more. Is it? Yeah, it is more. It's 20 cards more than you get in the mega. Alright, David Johnson. Obviously, a lot less rookies, though. Uh, Darius Leonard, Larry Fitzgerald, Allen Robinson, Daniel Jones, Tredavis White. Melvin Gordon, Aaron Donald, Darius Slayton, Cole Beasley, Joe Mixon. Oh my gosh, this is very a lot of cards. This is gonna take a lot of breath out of me. Deshaun Watson, Ryan Tannehill, Alvin Kamara, Kirk Cousins, Chase uh, Winovich, James Conner, Joe Sher Schobert, Anton Wood, and, and whatever George Kittle. His name is hard to pronounce. Aaron Rodgers, Anthony Barr, OBJ. Here we go. We got a numbered card. Uh, George Kittle, 104 out of 249. So I will sleeve. Uh, I'm not going to sleeve that right now. But I'll throw that throw that in the sleeve pile. Oh, wow. I actually like these. I think that these must be the hanger box inserts. <coughs> the exclusives. But the stars, they look really cool. So I'll sleeve all of them, actually. Cole Komet, uh, Devontae Parker. If there's a rookie out of here, out of this, I'll also top load it. Anton Winfield, that guy. Uh, George Kittle again. Uh, Jalen Darden, rookie. So Tampa, top load that. Lamar Jackson does it all in the playoff win. Disgusting. No. Uh. I I I don't know. I I'm not too big into Lamar Jackson. DK Metcalf. Um oh nice. Zach Wilson. I'll top load this one also. Season greetings. I'll top load that one and throw that up there. Uh Prestige Heroes, Kyler Murray. See, these hanger boxes are already better than the than those elite packs and those elite packs cost way more. Najee Harris, are these all rookies? Holy, I don't. I sure hope not. No, I don't think so. Uh, Jarrett Patterson, Trey Lance, I'll top load that. Cornell Powell, Jamar Chase. Uh, I will actually top load him. Zeke Elliott. Wait, he's not a rookie. All right, there we go. <laughs> Confusing. Holy cow, these packs are a lot. Uh, Chris Wilkins. I think the rest are. Vets, uh, Brandon Cooks, Quinton Nelson, Noah Fant, Matthew Stafford, DeAndre Swift, Manuel Sanders, D. Higgins, Philip Lindsay, it doesn't end, Jamie Collins, uh, Quinton Williams, DJ Chark Jr., Cross, Chris Godwin, Darren Waller, Russell Wilson, Chase Young, Julian Edelman, Deontay Johnson, Lavishka Chenault, Terry McLaurin, and Jalen Hurts, obviously, as we saw at the beginning. So I will actually top all these and just throw them up on there so that we get some 
some action on the podium. So, I see that I have quite a few more viewers now than I did at the beginning. So, I, I don't know if anyone missed anything, but if you did, um, you could go back, rewatch the beginning, the intro, if you would like where I did an intro on myself and basically just went over the rules of the break. Um, top line, Jamar Chase, because I think he's he's the wide receiver of this year by far. But uh, you could also, yeah, the rules. Um, basically, any penny points on random.org, someone will get them. And basically, the other big thing is um, college cards. I will send them to their current team that they're on. Uh, and it, if they're not on a team, so if they're retired even, or they are just not on a team, <coughs> I send them to who they got drafted by. So fun fact. Um, what's his name? Drew Brees goes to the Chargers. Fun fact. I've always sent him to the Chargers because he got drafted by the Chargers. Now, it's not that big of a deal because there's they're just base vet cards anyways and it's you want the rookies but if and there's there shouldn't be any Drew Brees autos in any of this stuff I'm opening up anyways. All right, so um I am about maybe over halfway done with Elite. Um I had about 30 40 blasters and I'm down to about 20. So the first one I opened, I, no, was it the first one or the second one? I think it was the second one I ever opened for a break. I got someone a Moxie card of Tyree Kill. Since then, I've only got one auto card, and it was some wide receiver for the Cowboys. So hopefully we get a Moxie today or an auto. It's been a while since I got a, a hit out of these, out of Elite. Now, I do love Donruss, but the new price on these, like what I said, is just outstandingly high. Like, the packs were 17 and these blaster boxes were 20 So, is this an auto? Oh, this might be an auto, actually. I don't know. I'm going to save it for last. Because that might be an auto. I d I'm not sure, though. It looked backwards. It looked like a backwards card. Kid Reporter in the back there. Justin Tucker. Juju. Justin Herbert. Patrick Mahomes. Sleeve up. And Joe Burrow. All Kid Reporter in the back there. Uh, Barry Sanders. Tom Brady. Davis Mills. I saw this guy play uh, in Green Bay. I'll top up this one since it's a rookie numbered card and a, and a parallel. Uh, Malcor Hardman Jr. and Jared Goff. <coughs> but yeah, the, he Davis Mills was the quarterback in the Green Bay Packer game. Um, so I saw him play. I don't think he's terrible. Better than some. Joe Mixon, Derek Carr, uh, Ed I'm not pronouncing his name, but that'll get sleeved. Joe Montana also gets sleeved, and George Kittle. So as I said before, also this is the base pile. This is these are the sleeve piles, and that's the top of the pile. So here we go. I believe we have an auto. So I'm gonna put this one in the back. It looked like a backwards card. I could totally be wrong. I've been fooled many times by Panini, but I believe we have an auto in our hands. So Chuba Hubbard is the rookie. Joe Montana, uh, Derrick Henry, AJ Brown, and it's S F E S F E E R A. Simi, <laughs> something fuck, whatever. Oh, again going to the Cowboys, number twenty of ninety nine this time. What in the world? These okay. The last one was a wide receiver I've never heard of. Is this the same guy? This can't be. No, I don't think it is. But literally, the last auto was some wide receiver out of the Cowboys I've never even heard of, ever. 
Man, that's so disappointing, but at the same time, well, at the same time, it explains why I haven't got an auto in a while. So, is he a wide receiver? Yeah, he's a wide receiver. I forget if this is who I pulled the last time, but this one is numbered 20 out of 99. So, Cowboys cut, cut an auto. And, holy cow, we're all the way to the last blaster. Donners. So, I did open one of these. I got five of them a few weeks ago off Target. Five of these blasters. Um, I love downtowns. I love Donners. Donners makes amazing product. So, hopefully we get downtown. I only opened up one of them for myself. I have four remaining. Actually, I have five more coming. So, I'm going to have this one plus... Uh, I don't know. So I'm going to have like nine total or maybe eight left after this break. Because I think tomorrow five more is coming. But <clears throat> love downtowns. So hopefully we get a downtown. And I don't know if anyone caught on also. But I am doing a rip and ship. So I have optic blasters. I'm doing for 75 each. Uh... I'll ship them with your cards if you're already in. And these, I've got five celebration tins. I'm doing 20 each. And those, uh, I've got five optic blasters. 75 each for those. So here we go. 246-01. Might be something good out of here since it's an 01. I don't know if that has anything to do with it. Empty box. You do get a lot of cards... For these, so I mean, these these were like the same price as an Elite Blaster, and look how many more cards you get, and you have the option to get a downtown. I'm feeling like probably going to get a downtown out of one of the four first ones I got. I don't know about the next five that I'm going to be getting, but I feel like a downtown is going to be out of at least one of these four, because <clears throat> they are uh, pretty common. They're not pretty common, but they are... Well, yeah, they're pretty common for the first batch, and this is from the first first batch or first wave. So, Kid Reporter in the back. Justin Jefferson. I actually traded for him in fantasy football. Gave up Saquon Barkley. Uh, Debo Samuel. Mike Vray Vrabel. AP. Is this an auto? No. That's, I remember this is how it was the last time. I was, I was confused. C.D. Lamb. Justin Jefferson again. Rookie Revelation. Najee Harris. A lot of Najee's coming out. And Havian Hawkins. Also, Raider rookies will get sleeved. All Raider rookies. And inserts out of downers. Wow. All right, the the blaster I opened up was pure garbage, by the way. So <laughs> that's typically how it is. Is anything I open up for myself is pure garbage, and I don't have the best luck with my products. But last break I did was all basketball. I swear there was. I'm not even kidding. Oh, I think I need to accept someone to the group. Yep. Um, I'm not even kidding though. The last break I did, there were, f I think five or six Lamellos. Three of them were base, or four of them were base. And one of them was a Lamello, the one that came out of the blaster of Select, that was. Um, and the other one was the Lamello that came out of the Mega Box. So that person racked up basically all the Lamellos they could get off me. Uh, Darius Slayton, I felt so bad for... Uh, Golden State because they paid like 40 bucks and they literally got two cards and they both were base cards. Uh, Ryan Fitzpatrick, Carson Wentz, Joe Namath. Oh, I'll, sh I'll show that since I just flipped it. Uh, Zeke Elliott, Corey Davis, signed by Jets. Matthew Stafford is red. Holy cow, that's Pretty bad. Uh, and Zeven Collins. Zeven Collins. 
So again, if you miss any part of the break, or if you miss if you missed or miss any part, you can rewatch it on on my page here. Uh, Jimmy Garoppolo, OBJ, uh, Hayden Hurst, Keenan Allen, Josh Allen, Alejandro Vill- something. Aaron Rodgers, nice. Road to Super Bowl. And Rashad Bateman. <clears throat> so I, I also do like to obviously talk a lot during my breaks because if I didn't, it would be pretty boring. And I've turned off some breaks that I've been a part of that have just been super boring. Um, but, I mean, if you if you get annoyed with it, you can mute me for sure. But forewarning, well, obviously not a forewarning, but <laughs> if you've caught on, I, I like to talk a lot during my breaks, keep it entertaining or interesting at least. Um, Travis Fulgham, Allen Robinson, JJ Watts. This holy cow! What is up with this card? I'm gonna look. We're gonna look at this at. What the world? <laughs> um, Kevin Ridley. Brett Favre, oh, I like that card. Followed by Adrian Amos. Followed by Tyree Kill. Followed by Pete Werner. Okay, let's look at this. At first I thought it was, like, bent, but it feels perfectly fine. So I'm thinking it's a printing error. So strange. Uh-uh. Alrighty. Evan Ingram. Yeah. Kid report in the back. Uh, Austin Eckler. Curtis Samuel. Peyton Manning. Devontae Adams again. A lot of Packers. Joe Namath. Justin Jefferson. I really like this card. And Trey Sermon. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six packs left. No downtown yet. Hopefully we get one out of this blaster. Hopefully. Uh, Oliver Vernon. Fletcher Cox. Michael Thomas. DeAndre Swift. Cooper Cup. Patrick Mahomes. Leo Mack and Zach Wilson. I'll top load him. Nice Raider right rookie. Creator report on the back there. Kareem Hunt. Miles Sanders. Andy Dalton. Um, one second. Julio Jones. Philip Rivers. Juju, Von Miller, and Kevin Joseph. Four packs left. Kid reporter in the back. Holy cow, a lot of kid reporters there. Uh, Devin Singletary, Jacoby Myers. Ivan Kears, I believe is how you say his name. Mark Ingram. Ryan Tannehill. Peyton Manning. Clyde Edwards Hilaire. And Irmer Smith, whatever, Marset. Hard to pronounce. Dang it, I saw the shininess and I was. Thought it would be maybe a downtown, but this pack didn't feel thick. I actually don't know if downtowns are thick. I, be- I th- believe so, but J.K. Dobbins. Uh, Stefan Diggs. I still have yet to get an on-campus card, and I've opened about 50 or 60 Prism Draft Pick Blasters. Hunter Henry. Barry Sanders. Taysom Hill. Dandere Hopkins. Ronald Jones Elite Series. And Haven Holland. Two more to go. Lots of kid reporters in this. 
product. Ndamukong Sue, Adam Thielen, Christian McCaffrey, Jalen Ramsey, Tom Brady, number two of the set. Followed by that one's going to the Patriots actually. Rob Gronkowski, Joe Schobert, and Carlos Boogie Bashman. Oh, that's Carlos Bashman Jr. Get a downtown not in this blaster. Shoot. That's disappointing. Tredavious White. James White. Lamar Jackson. Taylor Henneke. Deshaun Watson. Emmett Smith. TJ Watts. And Jalen Phillips. Alrighty, moving on to Chronicles Draft Picks. Mega, this is the last Mega I have. So it'll be... Uh, Quite interesting opening up this. Besides this, I will have Chronicles draft picks. Lots of blasters, lots of packs left. But this is the last mega. The last two I got out of here. The last two I opened actually have Panini points. So hopefully we're done with that. Uh, one eighty seven something. So I'm not. I can't let you guys choose a different mega box since uh, empty box since. <laughs> this is all I have left, but I will offer it. I'm going to let you guys choose no matter what, which one of the four um, Prison Draft Picks H2 hobby boxes I have left. Whatever one. But um, Prestige, I'll also offer that. I believe I have this one plus four others. So if anyone wants to swap this out for any of the other ones I have... I'll go get them, and you could choose whatever one. Otherwise, if it doesn't matter to you, um, we'll just open up that one. I think I started with seven or eight of those, maybe even nine of those, of these Prism Mega Boxes. None of them have been great so far, so hopefully they've been saving uh, the good ones for you guys. Or, just say, <laughs> or they just never send me anything good. Uh, Rondell Moore, which is probably the case. They probably just never, I just never get my hands on anything good. Devonta Smith, Elijah Moore, Mac Jones, and Terrence Marshall Jr. Rondell Moore, Travis Etienne. Najee Harris, lots of Najees. Oh my gosh, again Najee and Trevor Lawrence. I'll top load him. I'll top load that Trevor Lawrence. Nice hit. Or a nice card, I should say, since it's not a hit. Aziz Ajulari. Oop. Card fell. Jalen Waddle. Trevor Lawrence again. Jamar Chase and Dylan Moses. Also going to the Jags. No fields today. I don't even think any fields have come out yet. Devonta Smith. Maybe one fields has. Rashad Bateman. Terry's Tattoo Atwell. Rashad Bateman again. And speaking of fields, there you go. Top loading that. And also not many Mac Jones, so wouldn't that be something if this is a Mac Jones? Ian Book, Micah Parsons, Kadarius Tony, Trey Sermon, followed by Jalen Waddle. <clears throat> Haven't got the auto yet. Uh, Chubba Hubbard, Devonta Smith, Tamar and Terry, Jamar Chase, and Nico Collins. We got one, two, three, four, five, and six. So six packs left. Auto in here? Nope. Nico Collins. 
Followed by Jamar Chase, followed by Trey Lance, followed by another Jamar Chase, and Chateris Tattoo Atwell. Oh. Hopefully you don't didn't see that in the back. Michael Carter. Seth Williams. Sage Surratt. Jalen Waddle and Justin Fields. Top loading that. Nice. So there you go. Justin Fields. Justin Fields is who I'm personally PCing in. Pat Fearmuth. Justin Fields again. Okay, now we need some Mac Jones. Jalen Waddle. Carlos Bashman Jr. and Jamie Newman. Three packs left. One of these should have the auto. And it looks like the auto is in this one. So I'm setting that down. Going to open that one after these two. Or reveal that one after these two. Elijah Molden. Justin Fields. Rashad Bateman, Rondell Moore, and Kyle Pitts. Jamar Chase, Tylen Wallace, Mac Jones, Elijah Moore, and Michael Carter. All right, here we go with the auto. Put the auto in the back. There you go. All right. Elijah Moore. Kyle Pitts. Trey Lance. Should top on that one. Sean Wade. And the auto is MWB. Who is that? Mark Webb. Opened up quite a few of this guy's autos, actually. Not numbered or anything. But at least it was an auto. Not Panini points. Because we've been seeing a lot of Panini points recently. Knock on wood. Hopefully we don't get any more. All right, so on to the Prestige Mega Box. Um, I'm just going to open up this one, but I will let you all choose which one of the four um, Prism Draft Picks H2 Hobby Boxes you want. Well, we got Trevor Lawrence. Who fell over? All right, there we go. One, two, three, and four. So, I'll t I'll tell you how I let you guys choose at the end, or like after I'm done with this. Because, <clears throat> um, gotta make sure that it's fair. If anyone even cares to choose, because typically, actually, most of the time, people don't don't even care to choose. Uh, two oh nine oh two. Empty. All right, here we go. Four packs. Ten cards a pack. It's like, not the auto is in here, which is good. Uh, Leighton Vander Esch, Hayden Hurst, Travis Fulgham. First number card, Joe Schobert, 90 out of 299. Sleeve that up. Jimmy Garoppolo, sleeve that. And also sleeve this. Mike Williams, 71 out of 149. Uh... Prestigious Pros, T, uh, J.J. Watts, that is. Cody Pay, Sleeve, Caleb Farley, Sleeve, and Terrence Marshall Jr., Sleeve. So, any rookie with the logo, with the NFL logo, I will Sleeve for you guys. Like what I said, because they have the logo. Alright, I believe Auto is here, so set that one down, save it for last. 
I don't know if anyone saw, but not to spoil it or anything, but I believe the team color was red. Could be wrong, though. One time I thought it was red and it was orange. Miles Gaskin, Patrick Queen, Darius Slay, uh, Christian Wilkins, Ian Book. I'll top of this one since that's a rookie. Uh, number 207 out of 249, Javante Williams. I'll also top load that. Kadarius Tony. I will top load that one also. Hunter Long. He's an auto that I pulled out of a, a box once. Out of my first prestige mega box. So disappointed to see that. Evan McPherson and Peyton Turner. All right, last pack besides that auto pack. Cooper Cup, TJ Hawkinson, Justin Herbert, Fred Warner. Yeah, two is this. Jalen Phillips. Top of that. Ian Book. Ooh, nice. A lot of nice rookies in this one. 130 out of 199. Top of that. Tampa Bay, Devin White, Tyson Campbell, Penny Sewell, and Tommy Tremble. All right, here we go with the auto. Thank goodness it's an auto. And not the alternative. Keenan Allen. Uh, Jabril Peppers. Numbered. Jerry Judy. Kyler Gran Granson. Jamin Davis. Sage Surratt. T.Y. Hilton. Cortland Sutton. Devin Bush. The auto is, is it? Trey Lance Auto. Holy cow. Nice hit for San Francisco. This is definitely the best, and I mean the best auto I've ever pulled. So pretty excited to see this myself. Um, all the other autos, literally everything else I open is straight garbage. <laughs> not straight garbage, but not this good. good. And Trey Lance is one of the better, uh, he's definitely one of the better quarterbacks. So, holy cow, we got a Trey Lance auto. That is awesome. Nice hit for San Fran. San Fran actually paid quite a bit of money for this break, so awesome to see the circle come, come around. Um, it was either San Fran or who was the other one? Um, uh, New New England, New England. Yeah, that is a nice hit. Super awesome for San Fran. Awesome to see that. Either New England or San Fran are the top two selling teams for this break. Actually, surprised. Let I'm surprised. Chicago only sold for twenty, but um, any good Dolphins pulls? Try and think. <coughs> I don't think so. No. Had it been, had this been my first uh, prestige mega box I opened, then it I opened a Hunter Long auto then, but <laughs> not, not today, I don't think. So super nice hit. We got, you got base Trey Lance and then your auto Trey Lance. All right, so moving on to the um, the. Uh, Last part of the break, the Prism Draft Picks H2 Hobby Box. I have four available. Here's how it'll go. This is number one, number two, number three, number four. The first two numbers I see to match. So if I see two threes, the first number I see to match, one through four, is the box I will choose. And if no one chooses, then I'll choose one myself. Or if I only see one number, then they will... That's the one I'll choose, but pull me a Mac Auto now. Three. All right, so we've got one three. <clears throat> yeah, um, and one two. Uh, yeah, all right, so three. That's the one we're doing. Um, I, I sure hope we get you an auto. I sure hope we get you an auto. Because you two are the highest paying, we're the highest paying buyers but there's been so many times where I've had people pay like a hundred dollars plus 
for the Jags or the Patriots, and they got skunked. So at least at least it wasn't that high. All right, hopefully we get you a Mac Auto. All right, the last time I opened this, I opened it really funny, but I I learned that there's a way to open it like that. Just like that. Empty box. Set the other ones back there. Sweet. All right, hopefully we get some good cards. Finish this strong. This is over half, not over half, just about half of the break right, right here. This box alone, so hopefully it's good. Antonio Gibson. Amari Cooper. Patrick Mahomes. I'll sleeve up all the blues. Trey Sermon and Greg Rasu. Alright, looks like we have a red here. Travis Kelsey. Josh Allen. Devonta Smith, red. I will top load that. Nick Bolton and Pat Fumius. I don't think the reds are numbered. All right. Kareem Hunt, Cooper Cup, Sean Wade, Blue, I'll top of that. Rondell Moore and Mac Jones. There you go. Good start. Hopefully the rest of the box follows. Can we get an auto for you? Tua. J.K. Dobbins, Kareem Hunt, Rondell Moore, and Nico Collins. DeAndre Hopkins, Tyree Kill, Ben Roethlisberger, Zach Wilson, and Kyle Trask. Philip Rivers, Clyde Edwards Hilaire, Trevor <laughs> Trevor Lawrence. That's about as not as good as it gets, but that's a very nice hit for this box. Too bad that's not a Mac. Elijah Moore and followed by Mac Jones. He'll get top with it also. So this break is it's going really well for some. Not so great for others, but overall, compared to my other previous breaks and like the even the last the last uh, box I did of this, kicking, this is probably the best break I've done so far, as far as cards wise. The less or the the most luck I've I've had, getting the those good cards. All right, here we go. Got the auto in this pack, so we'll save that. Set that down. Save that for last. All right, Joe Mixon, Ryan Tannehill, Kyle Pitts. A lot of nice rookies actually coming out of those colored. Typically, the last one wasn't a lot of rookies. Sean Wade and Carl Spashman Jr. All right, four packs left. Meant to reveal that auto. Teddy Bridgewater, Vishka Chenault, Clyde Edwards Hilaire. Amy Hawkins and Devonta Smith.
DeAndre Swift, Jalen Hurts, Chris Godwin, Jason Owa, and Greg Rasu. Two more to go. And then show that auto. C.D. Lamb, Tom Brady, Kylan Hill going to the Packers. That's a silver. Very nice card. Rashad Bateman and Sage Surratt. Mike Evans, Kirk Cousins, Rondell Moore, Haven Holland, and Jamie Newman. All right, on to this auto. The team did look red. I'll be honest, it looks red, so that could be a good sign for Justin Fields and Mac Jones. Kadarius Tony, Amon Ron St. Brown, Jared Steidem, Saquon Barkley, Najee Harris, Najee Harris auto. Holy cow. Nice hit. And the Steelers, Steelers, whoever had the Steelers didn't pay for the Steelers at all. That is an amazing hit, actually. I am very, uh, very happy for you for picking up the Steelers. Um, unfortunately, not, not a, a Mac Jones. But right when I saw that NJH, I knew right away that it was gonna be Najee. So, awesome hit. That really worked out for you at the end, picking up Pittsburgh. Holy cow! That is insane. Um, two very good autos. I'll say that. Two very good autos. Damn, yeah, that is a very good hit. I'll, I'll say that. I don't, I haven't seen much Najee, uh, autos out there even, but I really like this. That's an amazing card. Um, f and then the Trey Lance. We even got a Elite auto, which is super cool. So... Not ever like it wasn't just one person who who got a lot of good cards. Even the Jags got some nice hits here. Um uh the Bears didn't get too great because uh well I mean the Bears and the Patriots didn't do too great. The Bears didn't uh actually won the Bears sold for not that much anyways, so it wasn't a total bust for them, but that's a that's a beautiful card. That's probably my favorite card I've ever opened in a break. I mean, I, I was in shock about that. But this card, I love these. All right, so awesome, awesome break. Um, I will have these all sorted tonight. I'll have them shipped to you tomorrow or tonight. I mean, I'll do the labels tonight, but they'll be dropped off tomorrow, so... Thank you all for participating in my break. Oh yeah. Um I'll I'll keep it going for maybe a few more minutes. If anyone is interested in any of these optic blasters I have, um I've got uh five optic blasters and five of these Pokemon tins. If anyone's into Pokemon, it's a new release. Otherwise, five blasters. Um it's 20 for a tin and 75 for a blaster. Uh, free shipping. <clears throat> Best brick. Yeah. <laughs> right? <laughs> Honestly. And, and it's hilarious because typically that's how it happens is the Steelers, that, Steel, that Najee card, the, the, uh, typically the teams that if someone bids on them and they don't, pay that's how this one was was with the Steelers was they bid on the Steelers and they won them for like 16 bucks literally the only team that didn't pay and got an auto right right out of there and it's happened before where I mean some non-payers from the Houston uh, from Houston and Indianapolis once pulled a Houston and Indianapolis auto out of that break so it is very uh very cool to see that though the reason why they took the Steelers they said that they don't even like the Steelers is because uh of Najah Harris and to get that auto is very cool
that was definitely my best break for sure. Um, there's, a, there's only one way to go, and that's up. And hopefully, hopefully that's the beginning. Hopefully we get some uh, Justin Fields, some tra uh, Trevor Lawrence's, some Mac Jones next. So I'm just going to top all these cards. I'll keep it rolling for a little bit. If anyone's interested in any of these uh, optic blasters I've got or the Pokemon, let me know. Free shipping. I'll rip it live for you. Otherwise, if you want it sealed, um, I will do the same price sealed. Actually... Got five Optic Blasters and five of those Pokemon tins. A lot of top loaded cards for this break. Very good. One, two, three, four, five, six, <clears throat> well, I finish up top line these cards. If I if I get all the way done, or if I finish up with these cards, I think I have ten more to top load. Um, by the time when I get done, if no one's interested in any of the optic or Pokemon I have, then I'll just end it. But just so I would offer it in this group a rip and ship, or if you want one, if you want a sealed thing. If you want one of them sealed, a uh, Optic Blaster or Pokemon Tin, I'll send it to you sealed also. Um, Christopher, you have... I don't know if Christopher's watching. He's asking me if there's any Bucks hits. Uh, not... Not a whole lot of good Bucks hits for this break. A few Kyle Trasks. Which is decent. I think Kyle Trask is going to be a good QB. But it's when... Tom Brady will leave if he's going to still be around.
Mm -mm. Alright, I think I got four cards left, so last call for Optic, if anyone wants Optic. I don't know if anyone here is into basketball, but these came from Target. We got five of them. Five available. Or if anyone was into Pokemon, that new Pokemon stuff that came out. We got um, five mini tins for 20 bucks. Which is a pretty decent deal. Because I think online they're going for 25 Plus tax. All right. Last call, uh, Optic. If not, if no one takes it, I'll just set it over on my shelf of cards. But once again, holy cow, these two cards, these three cards, really, were some good cards. Some good cards. I'm going to end the end the video, so hopefully everyone has a good night, and hopefully I see you in some future breaks. See ya.